Hi everyone, I'm in the Gaylord area of Chicago and right behind me is the home of Sam DiStefano, also known as Mad Sam. He was a, a juice collector for the Chicago outfit and he was active between late 1940s to until his death in 1973. DiStefano gave out loans to desperate people, notably gamblers with a very high interest rate, sometimes between 25% to 50%. And if you didn't pay him on time, you would get tortured. <laughs> he was really insane. And this house right here, he had a torture chamber in his basement where he would take his victims and just torture them for days, like burning them stabbing them with ice picks, hitting them with hammers. Sometimes he would resort to murder. So he, he's, a lot of people died in his house. There was one story where this gambler uh, stole some money from him and he lured him to his house, tortured him for a day, and invited his entire family to urinate on him in his house to further humiliate him. But he lived, luckily. <laughs> so he was eventually whacked because he uh, was going. He was going to rat out everyone in the syndicate. So we were approaching the place where he got whacked by his own brother Mario and another hitman, Tony Spalatro. And right in his garage is where he uh, was killed. He uh, was shot by Spalatro with a shotgun and took his arm right off. And I'll show you a photograph of it. Well, anyway, this is my story on the most evil uh, killer in mob history, Mad San DiStefano. Thanks for watching, and uh, I'll have more of a... Uh, uh, gangster videos because I like doing Chicago mobsters and gangsters alike so watch out for those I'll have uh, a few more for you well thank you very much bye bye